get off the blocks. Two losses in three games. That was a beautiful ball. Outside off. So after 4.3 overs, you need group 34 for no lost. Bull are coming in steaming and that was a good shot. And that's going to be, oh my god, that was a drop catch over. 2 for 16. Harish the man on strike. Another shot, Dilby. That looks like another catch over there. It's a corner ball chance and yes, it is taken. It is a... Come back to him in a little bit. The call is out and that's it. Another wicket departs. The bats. Next ball coming in. Uh, that's another appeal. Fifth ball of the over coming. Rise. Steaming in. And that is played up. And that's a drop catch over that. Third ball of the over. Rasik and strike. A short delivery top edged. Is that going to be a catch? And that's another ball of the over coming up. Third ball would say and a well developed delivery and a well developed comeback into the game. But Eldo's over has brought in quite a bit of spike for Stallions as we speak. Uh, going really well, a long tournament, a lot of teams have been playing. You beat me having a lot of issues with maybe the. It was a chance of a catch, maybe. Commends for it by picking up the catch that was looped up into the air by Kadresh. So Nabil takes his wicket, a much deserved wicket for. Like I said before, everything is going to happen for the best, don't worry. That's a really good shot put out over there, and that's a boundary. The bus. From the time of Asin Wenga. Um, any pure football fan would surely be almost every six months you're having a World Cup, which is not what exactly is a World Cup. Meanwhile, as we speak, Sham balls it outside off. But these days, the spinners are trying to only ball the full length delivery because they're trying to turn it, and there was a it was up in the air for a while. The bowler has been pitching the ball up. Well, another full pitch with this time goes up in the air. Is there going to be a catch? And tempting the batsmen to play, but the batsmen aren't connecting that. Another delivery, a similar delivery. Cuts that well. Well played for a boundary. 0.203 for four. Unique group. They pass the man on strike to Hamid. Another full pitch delivery that slog sweep it hard. And that's caught. That's it. 109 for five. Um, eight, 21 balls remaining. The ball is, it's another catch and dropped. It's, as we speak, there's a white ball on the leg side and taken for two runs. And Nabil's bowling, now a stumping chance of John's bowling. All have been missed. Finally gets the stumping of the same batsman. And five runs on the scoreboard for Arabian Stallions. Very unusual feel for a pace bowler. Vinod means while guides a ball going to Salim gets back a cow corner, so he'll be bowling it full. Looks like it. Ganesh hits it towards long on for a much needed boundary. He has a deep mid wicket in place along with a cow corner. Lofts the ball. And Nitin, meanwhile, comes for his fourth ball off this over. Hit on the shin and was not able to run much. Was grimacing with pain. Amazing ground and hell of a lighting. Amazing lighting. One of the best lighting I've ever seen. And uh, such a nice pitch for the ball. Oof, out. For the ballers... The inform Ganesh and bowls his fourth ball and it's absolutely hammered over.
no lbw smashes another one towards long rasika goes full head outside extra cover for a bounce that was actually a good ball but was hit for a four it can be stopped so rasika choosing to choosing to bowl ball shorter on his we finally could restrict them to 128 that's 128 and a superb six by all along the ground for a single rajai pc means while waits for a ball play off spin he's bowling off spin as of now and vinod whacks it over long on for a six hits the first ball of pc takes stance a beautiful square cut behind square position of 8.4 overs when or smashes a short ball over long on for yet a chetan tries to get, bring in varai uh no ball b venod lofts it over extra cover 